Hi guys, it's um, it's me Denise. I would like to um, share with you guys. I got a swap in the mail. This was my very first swap that I had ever done, um, and I didn't know what to expect. I didn't know really what a swap was. I had never participated in one, and um, I had some surgery, and I thought, well, I'm gonna have to find something to do to um, pass my time over the next seven weeks. So I met a young lady online and we started talking about just doing a personal swap with one another. And um, she was in Australia, okay? So this young lady and I decided that we would do this swap and we would exchange just a few things was, you know, not supposed to be a big swap. It was just a small personal swap. I think she may have done one more prior to um, meeting me. Uh, and I had never done one. And I was truly trying to think out of the box because YouTube, you know, the internet, swaps, that kind of stuff was not something um, that I myself had ever been part of. Um, I do a lot of nail art, a lot of 3D stuff, and as those of you that have followed my channel know that that's kind of how I got a YouTube channel. So many people have, you know, constantly asked me to, you know, to do something with 3D art. So finally I took a chance and I did. Again, thinking out of the box, um, because I have a professional job. I, like I said, don't, I'm not on the internet very much. I have a Facebook. I... You know, I lead a very personal life. There's very little information about who I am, my family, my friends on my Facebook. Um, I, I just pretty much keep to myself. So I met this young lady and again, I, you know, was thinking outside the box and thought, okay, I'm going to give this a try. I, I got to do something for the next so many weeks. So we got our stuff together and I felt like we both added, you know, extra stuff to our swap and we felt good about it and we were just doing this because this is supposed to be fun and you know I was you know recovering from surgery and so grateful to have met this young lady who you know wasn't constantly you know like a part of my life now but would message me here message me there and it really really was instrumental in my recovery and I really did enjoy and do enjoy um all of the contact that I have with her. I got my swap the other day and I it, it took me a couple days to make the video because I have gone back to work. Um, I have a very, very busy work schedule. I write my own schedule and um, I oftentimes um, I don't necessarily work long hours, just I have a busy schedule. Um, and actually I may be in the process of switching jobs, but that's an entirely different story. So I get home, I'm tired, I'm sore, you know, it's my first week back for, to work. Her swap arrives. The poor little thing came, it's not even little actually, I shouldn't use that word, came all the way from Australia and took a beating in shipping. So I knew that I was not going to make a video until I could take a few moments to try to put it all back together. And I, I got up early today and I've done that. I want to share with you um, my very first swap ever with um, the wonderful uh, Lizzie Prosser, I think is how you say her name. Um, this swap, girls, guys, has blown me away. Um, this young lady was so generous and so giving. Um, I was not expecting this. I feel at some point maybe like I'm not even worthy of it. I sent her a swap. I don't think it was a chinsy swap. I think I sent her, you know, a fair deal of stuff, but I in no way, shape, or form sent her as many um, mixes and stuff as she sent me. So I was overwhelmed, and I just, I, Lizzie, I don't even know where to begin to say thank you. So my um, thought was, I'm going to put it all back together the best that I can, because you guys, this is a swap that it, it deserves to be seen um and I didn't want it to be seen you know the way it arrived because I she spent a lot of time and money on this swap and um she deserved better than that because you know it, it just 
Australia is a far way from, you know, it's a very long distance from Ohio um, in the USA. So with that said, and me rambling on already, I, I would love to share this swap with you. Like I said, it came from Australia and she spent $30 on the shipping alone, um, which that just blew me away too because it was, it, I just can't even imagine um, anybody not knowing me and just wanting to do something like this. And, and I, I, again, I just, this is out of my typical element. So I am just overwhelmed with um, just joy that she shared this with me. So it came um, in these little sleeves, these page protectors. Um, I won't read the note. Well, I will read the note. It just says, my dearest friend Denise, thank you so much for doing this small swap with me. And by small, I mean huge. She's not kidding. <laughs> I really hope you like all of the goodies and I hope and hope you find something unique. Uh, love always, Liz. Then she has an index that I tried to follow as I put these things um back together so she was kind enough to send me pages of what these are um, apparently she has sent me a lot of her complete glitter mixes so with that said I Lizzie I do not have the pages in order that they came um, I needed to like take them out and some where you guys might see clear tape they did not come to me like that they all came with these very cool little stickers on them um, it's just there was some settling in the shipping, so if you see tape on them, she did not put that on there. I did. So we're just going to go page by page, and I just want you guys to see, um, are we at the beginning? All of these beautiful mixes. This is page one. And, and when I say all of, there, there's just a ton. And then on the back of here... Um, I believe these look, some of these look like acrylic mixes too. Like this one here looks like it might be, but I'm thinking it might be a color pigment. So uh, when I catch up with you, Lizzie, I do want to find out. But we've got Bubblegum Fairy. Oh, can you see it? I'm sorry. Garden Party, Fun in the Sun, Beach Party, Hailstorm, Banshee, which I really like this one. Uh, don't mind my nails, guys. Original Barbie and Cupcake Sprinkles on this side. And I am fairly proud of myself because I put this back together. <laughs> uh, and I will read the names to the ones that she's named, but they're not all named. So then we have the second page, or my second page. And I'm just going to let you guys see these. That's the first row. There's a blue one here on the side. This is, these are so beautiful too. Um, yellow, silver, pink. This is one of my favorites. Um, they're just, I mean, really beautiful. And then we got this side. I can't, I can't even count these. I, I couldn't tell you. Um, when they first came because of the settling, they were just bags of, you know, tiny little bags of, this is really pretty too, of glitter and like mixes. And I was just overwhelmed. I want you guys to see this too, because here in the U.S. I've never seen like a yellow like this. And my camera's not doing it total justice. Um, and I think like in some of these mixes, I'm going to take this one off. She has like rhinestones in them. Um... Yeah, here's another one that has like a blue rhinestone in it. Never would have thought to do that myself, but this is like the second one I've found that has that. Um, actually, just set that aside now. And then there's these two here. Third page. Um, some spangles, crafting stuff. <clears throat> I'm thinking that she sent like this kind of stuff for me to decorate with. So, um, I don't do a lot of scrapbooking, um, don't, uh, foresee myself doing it, but at least when I send out swaps and stuff, now I have something, little mirrors, um, that I can put, like, on them to decorate. So then we started, uh, she started with spangles. There's an orange iridescent hexi and a pink iridescent hexi. And we've got some female 
You can see that? There's some Fimo, looks like blue hearts, purple hearts. Um, looks like the little candy, the little pink hearts that say love. Little strawberries, red hearts, and pink hearts with, I think, strawberries. Then we have some little purple rhinestones. She sent me this cute little box that has like nail files in it that I will take to my work and leave in my drawer of my desk. And I'm gonna pull this out because I've never seen anything like this and it was really neat. Um, oh, geez. Yeah, I'm really pulling it out. She sent this box of their instant metal like glam. So they must stick like to your nails. How cool is that? I've never seen anything like that here in the United States. Not as prominent as this. So very cool. And then next to it, there was these strips here of beads or like rhinestones. And then these. So did I get this? I did. Okay, so we'll leave that there. This is so, I mean, it is overwhelming. She has sent me so much stuff, you guys. I just... As I look at it, I, I, I just, I don't know what to say besides thank you. Um, there's more. <laughs> so we've got pink, gold, green, another pink. This is a beautiful blue. Um, the lighting in my house does no justice. Red, another green, a very cool orange. I really don't have like any oranges, so that's really cool. Um, purple, teal blue, another pink like a pinkish, very cool orange. My daughter's gonna like that one. Green, um, pink. This is a black, another blue, another yellow. I like this, it's like a chocolate brown, a white, and a purple. On the Spangles, then she has sent me uh, large gold, uh, I think those are Hexies large green hexes and then I've got orange blue pink white like um, crossover like swirls these are actually like a metallic yellow hexy an iridescent purple hexy an iridescent pink hexy a large silver more of the swirls these are very cool colors. We've got a like a bright orange, a bright yellow, a bright green, a bright purple, a bright blue, and a beautiful pink. So we got all that in this one. And then these were some acrylic mixes that she has. So she's given me one of her own nail bed, um, an NSI Totally Clear, an NSI Radiant White, NSI uh, Radiant Pink, and then these are very, very cool. These are color pigments. Um, so this one here is Carrie's Fairy Dust from, I think, Essence Cosmetics. This one here is Marine Ultra from MAC. This is Neo Orange from MAC. This is beautiful. There was no name on it, but I really, really love this one. Um, there's a teal from MAC um, and an Edwards Love from Essence Cosmetics. <laughs> These two little ones I just put on here because there were so many glitter mixes. I, I just kept, I, I didn't, I ran out of room, so I'm sorry, Liz. Uh, so yep, yeah, there's that. And then I believe this is her Wizard of Oz collection. I'm not sure because I, like I said, so many of them were out of the thing, Liz, that I, I just, I don't even know how to um, show them because I don't know that I have them in the right spot. So we've just, I'm going to share these with you. They're just beautiful. And then on the other side, I know that these didn't go in this order, but I didn't know what else to do with them. Um, so these, I put all like the brown ones together. I believe this is a color pigment as well, um, just by the texture of it. A glitter mix. These look to be like um, glitter mixes with color pigment already in them. So we've got a blue one, a purple one, a pink one. This is one of my favorites. You guys know I love dark stuff. 
it it's like a peacock like dark emerald like green this one i'm sorry liz but it actually did come out of the bag and this glitter was everywhere um i think it has rhinestones in it too and maybe that's what happened i'm not sure but it was in the entire package so you guys can still see i left it so you could see because this is really pretty what she made too um, and then there's an orangish kind of like a burnt sienna like color looking one. So that is everything that I got from my swap with um, Liz Prosser. So Liz, I, I can't thank you enough. Um, doing this swap with you has, you know, been really, really, really neat to do. Um, I won't go into details, but I learned a lot about like people and what my impression and what my thought of the internet might be. Um, I think that I have just always been an overly suspicious person as far as, you know, people that I don't know. I'm not typically very trusting. Um, I'm ashamed to admit, you know, at some point I had some doubts and I thought, well, God, what if I send this and she doesn't send anything back or, you know, or is this like, real because I had never done this before um so let me tell you guys this was a very real swap um <laughs> I don't know um if I will continue to them, do them I feel like I need to because during that seven weeks you guys cannot imagine the glitter and stuff that I've bought to continue to do these um so I have uh really stocked up on things to be able to share with other people and I just want to thank you, Lizzie, for allowing me to do this with you and allowing me to learn and see in my life that, you know, it is okay to take a chance. Um, the internet can be a dangerous, scary place, but, you know, if you certainly if you have children, you have to consider that. But as an adult, it was someplace that I had never even attempted to venture out in. So I don't want to ramble or babble, but, you know, I, I think that this has allowed me to definitely see outside of my box. Like I said, I have a professional job that, you know, I am very wary of people just because of the nature of the type of work that I do. Um, so, yeah, I if you were here, Liz, I'd give you a big hug and just say, oh, wow, you know. Oh my God, you, we decided on a couple of things and this is just amazing. Um, she was so sweet to me because I'm like, now you're not going to want it like all decorated and fancy schmancy and all that stuff. And she's like, nope, I'm just, I'm really simple. If that's what you want to do, that's fine. So if, if um, this looks toned down or something to you, I think she was very creative in what she did. Um, shipping is very, very expensive to go from Australia to here. You guys saw the sign and I wanted to get the credit for that too. Um, she spent $30 on shipping and their money is worth a little more than ours here in, you know, the United States down there. So for her, that was probably a little more than, you know, that than it would have been here. Um, I know mine was about $23 to send her. So, I mean, she really had, had just made my recovery period a, a good thing um, for me. So I wanted to take the time, Liz, and I wanted to try to do my best to put it back together because you definitely deserve credit for this. So thank you, dear. Um, and until my next video, you guys take care and be safe out there. Bye.